guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new, I'm Cognitive Connections. Um, a lot of different stuff going on, but we'll avoid that for now. You can check out my other videos to see what kind of stuff I have, gift-wise. I do have death premonitions and stuff like that. It runs in my family. I come from a long line back from Italy. If you do have death premonitions and you're someone that also has that, the dreams usually start at 21 which um, anyone that's had them that I've currently met, there's only two. Same thing as me happens two days later, and um, they get more accurate the more you get older. But we're going to check in and see how your person is currently feeling in this current moment. I'm also being told something about the lymphnotic system or lymphnodic system really heavily, so if you need to go to the doctors, I recommend checking that out. I'm also being told for you guys to know, like, I know my nails look like shit right now, but people really pay attention to your nails to see how, like, clean you are. Taking showers and baths is really important. Like, just coming off clean your nails, like, pretty girl stuff, you know? Even guys, like, girls pay attention to your fingernails, no matter if we want to or not. Hands just, people seem to go to hands a lot. So I recommend, you know, if you're so focused on someone else, like you might not be taking care of you that much, and that's important. You might want to treat yourself to get your nails done or something. These hands. Get your nails done. Fishies. All right. So there is someone that holds you extremely close to their heart. This person could be working right now or at work, because we have the Eight of Pentacles. They're also trying to work on something. I feel like this person's trying to stop time or buy more time. If you see me itching a lot, I'm very itchy right now. It happens when I channel. This could be a King of Pentacles. This person can lose themselves at work. This person could be a workaholic. I'm getting the hands are very significant, so maybe they do something for work with their hands. They could type. They could do general labor. Um, I'm getting this person is, like, barricading themselves at work. And this is a lover. This is someone that feels a very special connection to you. You could feel a very special connection to them. There is an angel watching over you. This could be an archangel. This could be a goddess. I'm getting something about colors too right now. If there's been a color you've been super drawn to recently. Sorry. If there's been a color you've been super drawn to recently, I would check out that color and see what's associated with it. Maybe there's some shockers that you need to work on. Also, um, for instance, if you have a drinking problem or anything like that, you could be used to constantly drinking or like taking swigs of something. Get yourself water or tea or something that's gonna hydrate you and make you like look youthful and young longer. This person can be having a problem with their throat chakra right now. I'm really picking up on that energy, and I just started to have a speaking problem going into this, which I didn't before. So I am going to read this in reverse so it's a little more accurate and clear for you guys. I am being told to use the book. I usually don't. I just did the past two readings for some reason, or reading. So this person could feel, they could either feel like this is you or this could be them right now. Being a victim, feeling helpless, using your stories or past experiences as, ex as excuses to remain sh shackled. So not only is this person having a hard time speaking, <laughs> but they're using old stories. They can be doing the blame game like, oh, my life ended up this way for this reason, 444 four, four on the clock. They could even be blaming you for being in the situation they're in right now, even if 
they physically did this with their own hands or they physically spoke all this stuff into existence. This person could be blaming you for what's going on in their life right now, even though it was their own doing. I am getting this is either a soulmate or a twin flame. This is a blessed connection. There is an angel watching over you specifically very heavily right now. They could be guiding you. You need to listen to your intuition more. No matter how bad you want something to be true, if you have this off feeling or like something's wrong or something's going on, listen to your intuition. Now, under the lovers, we have the Queen of Wands. So this person can see you as very, very attractive. I'm getting butterflies and goosebumps and chills. Yes. Ace of Swords. This person could be having major clarity right now. They could be playing the victim, but they're coming out of this mentality. They're coming out of being in a mental imprisonment because of all the clarity. And because of this extreme amount of clarity, they could be trying to play the victim because that's maybe what they had to do when they were little or growing up. Under the King of Pentacles, we have the Hermit, so Virgo energy as well. Someone is shining a light to the injustices that were done. Someone is shining a light on this situation or what's been going on. Someone can even be holding something over one, two, three on the clock, so this is correct. Someone can be holding something over someone's head of a way they made money or what they did so this person doesn't come forward towards you. And there's a lot of fighting between them and conflict. Like I said, you need to listen to your intuition, the high priestess. Someone can see you as very special. They see you as like this star-like figure, but like you hold this light, you hold this star. And this person's very possessive over you. There is someone here, one, two, three on the clock, so that's correct, and 13, well, three, three, three. Someone sees you as theirs. So they do see you as 414 as well, 414. They do see you as this soulmate, or they see you as a twin flame. It's almost like this person has claimed you. And this person that wants to come forward and hold a light to the situations of all the wrongdoings that this person did, 515, they're in a mental imprisonment. They're scared. There's a lot of fighting between these friends or coworkers or family. Someone doesn't want some truth coming out. But your person is having clarity moments right now on the situation, who they're dealing with, and who you are to them, and how special you are to them. This person sees you as majestic, almost. They see you as a light, a star, their sun. This person, even if they act like they hate you, like they consider you theirs, like they claimed you. This could be a Scorpio. But also, maybe you're going through this complete metamorphosis state, like someone burned you bad, burned you to ashes, and you're coming back rising like the phoenix. It's like these people can't take you down. This person, all they did was make you bloom even more out of nothing. Into a queen of pentacles. So we have the queen and king of pentacles. This is a counterpart pair and match. And someone wants to give you an apology. So right now, what's going on with your per person is they literally quite are going through a metamorphosis state. There's an old 818 on the clock, which is also for like love means the one. But they're going through a complete metamorphosis state. This person, tower, like has the rug ripped out from under their feet. They're seeing things for what they are right now. The clarity that's in front of them. They could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Leo or a Leo Scorpio. But they're trying to muster up the strength. They could also see you very strong. 
I feel like they have to defend themselves right now with the Strength card and the Seven of Wands. Now, the Seven of Wands is defending yourself, but I just want to... And King of Cups. So this person is in love. They're very emotional right now towards you. And Nine of Cups, they could be drinking a lot. But they see you as wish fulfillment. And they want a passionate new beginning with you. This is someone that you could have walked away from. We just got 888 again. And Temperance, Balance. There are good things coming towards you right now. And I feel like you are unaware of this. Like you're blindfolded to this. There's a lot of competition around you, and I'm just getting like you're minding your own business and not paying attention to it. So challenge grounding and protecting yourself. Movement and growth. Creative innovation. Remaining ahead. Feeling vulnerable. A sign to continue to share your ideas and self-expression. I'm, I'm getting, like, this person going through this metamorphous state and spiritually waking up. It's like, they feel more comfortable being themselves. I'm getting, like, you awaken something in them. And since you walked away or left, like, this has, like, made this person undergo this transformation. And I flip to the Nine of Cups, Nine of Cups. Like, this person sees you as wish fulfillment. And I flipped a King of Cups. This person sees you as wish fulfillment. This person is heavily in love. I'm getting you closed a cycle on this. I got the world, devil, and Scorpio energy, death. Someone does have some unhealthy things. Or an unhealthy partner, friend, co-worker. Like, they have something unhealthy. But you... The universe is gifting you your desire, choosing joy, manifested dreams, gratitude, and abundance. This is a card of abundance and happiness and is often fittingly called the wish card. What have you been wishing for? Allow yourself to experience how fulfilling this journey can be and fill your life with all the laughter and bliss needed to spur you into the next phase of your happiness take stock of all the feels that are surfacing and remember to practice gratitude for the manifestation of your dreams the appearance of this card in your spread is an auspicious message of prosperity harmony and getting what you desire what have you been working towards what you have been working towards is coming to you so enjoy life's pleasures and sink into the awe and wonder of your joyous heart. Like I said, there's something like coming towards you that you don't even know. This is beautiful and exciting. You can claim this reading if you want. <laughs> I want to claim this reading, but I don't feel like this is my energy and I'm not dealing with any of these people. So whoever's reading this is, let me know. And let me know what comes towards you, too. I am open my grateful heart to the gifts that are coming my way. I open my grateful heart to the gifts coming my way. So your affirmation, and I will say it the third time correctly. I open my grateful heart to the gifts that are coming my way. King Cups again. So they do want me to read this one love emotional intelligence patience experience stability and balance creativity diplomacy someone supportive being a nurturer and a wise leader my heart holds deep wisdom and love and i use it to connect and lead this person is entering a phase where they're really finding themselves more i feel like there is a lot of mental confusion with them right now and they may come out of being really angry all the time. I am getting a really toxic housing situation or a toxic work environment. There is something very toxic in this person's life that's causing them a lot of stress. Two of Cups. 
they could be stressing out over this relationship with you. You are on their mind. Two of Cups. Like, this person, and that's on wish fulfillment and strength. This person really needs to muster up the strength. And we have King and Queen of Wands. So we have... We, don't, we literally have two counterparts here, but... You guys could make a lot of money with the Queen and King of Pentacles together. You go after your creative ideas. It doesn't matter what age you are. A lot of people watch, like, a bunch of different shit. But this person is very heavily attracted to you. They could also be very attractive. They can be an entrepreneur. They can make really good money. Or when you guys come together, they could make a lot of money that way as well. And they're really in their feelings. They could be manifesting you. But what I'm also getting is you're manifesting the life of your dreams. You do have a wish fulfillment coming in. Remember, you create your um, reality. All you have to change is your mind. And watch everything else change. Change your principles and perspectives. This person could be working with moon magic or someone they're involved with could be working with moon magic. I'm going to see if this is past or future. We also have Aries, Pisces, and the Eight of Cups walking away. Someone can be walking away from someone they were involved with that was doing this. Or this person is doing black magic. Someone that they're involved with could also be doing this to you or on you. Someone wants someone to walk away. What is this Eight of Cups about? Heartbreak. Queen of Swords. Six of Cups. So this is from the past. So someone was doing a bunch of shady ass shit and you walked away from the situation or somebody walked away from the situation. This broke somebody's heart. It could have put someone in a logical frame of mind, like mindset, where they decided to cut out the toxic stuff. It could be work, it could be friends, family, lovers. Someone decided to walk away and cut out the shit so they could go towards abundance and happiness. Because whatever was going on in this situation, it was no longer serving. And it was breaking someone's heart. So this person left took their broken heart and decided to move forward but this is past what's future well once again past like crying over spilled milk like sadness someone walked away and someone actually is really upset over it yes they want a new passionate beginning there is a new creative passionate beginning coming towards you you might be expecting an apology and victory and success that's what happens when you leave toxic shit or stand up for yourself. Not in an arrogant way, but... You're on a chariot moving forward towards abundance and happiness. Someone could get pregnant with twins soon, or you could have a daughter or son or someone in your family that has twins. Twins could be significant. You could also be dealing with a cancer that is very toxic. We also have... Capricorn energy. Yeah, you could be dealing with someone with cancer in their chart that is very toxic. You know, this isn't the chariot. This is the emperor. So there could be an Aries still stuck in devil toxic energy. Yes, the sun. person could sacrifice animals they want an equal give and take can you give me more clarification on this real fast there's still illusions when it comes to this person this person could end up leaving you out in the cold because they're flighty but they want to take forward action they're planning something. The ultimate betrayal. This person's planning the ultimate betrayal. 
someone could want someone dead. An Earth Angel. Temperance Sagittarius. Someone could be trying to come towards you and because they're so in love or this or that or because they don't know what they're feeling. This person has been plotting and planning possibly with a Scorpio as well to cause a death. This keeps coming out. Someone wants to cause a death to an Earth Angel. A Princess of Cups. Because they're heartbroken. They see you moving on with your, their life. A Taurus could also be involved. The sad thing is this person wants the Ten of Pentacles with you. What I'm getting is you're going to give a period. Is that true? They're trying to deceive your Ten of Pentacles. They don't want you to have it. And they're working in a collaboration to do this. But you're going to get justice. Everything's going to come to the light. These people will be caught. These people have a fixation and an obsession on you. Yeah. You have manifested dreams coming in. Stay far from these people. This is something you're going to be able to celebrate. And you're going to get the Ace of Pentacles. A lot of money, a gift coming in. Because you're releasing burdens. Weigh out your options. Figure out what you need to do. Stay away from these fucking people. Because you're intuitive. You're kind. And they want you stuck in a stalemate. They want you blindfolded, not seeing what's going on. But you're the Nine of Pentacles, the Queen of Cups. You're like all four queens, the Empress. You need to release these burdens. Because they're just trying to wound you. Your twin flame can be dark or evil or toxic. Yeah, close the cycle of the world. Don't trust them. Tower. This is sick. This person's like in love with you, but they fucking hate you at the same time. Don't go near them. The one you're having sleepless nights, they're going to rush in. You need to, like, it's such a weird energy. It's literally like they're in love with you, but they want to fucking kill you at the same time. They made up so many lies to themselves and other people and all these illusions that they feel like they have to go along with this plot or this plan. This could also be magic from the person they're with. That's a yes for me, the Wheel of Fortune. They could also be... Um, I have to put my phone in. Which we call it. The person they're with could have been doing magic on you or to you for a long time to make this person hate you as well. So that's just something like you need to be weary of. Um, this is just a fucked up situation. And just really watch your back. Be careful. 23 23 on the clock and don't trust them unless the person comes to you with like authenticity and is true about everything that happened do not trust this person if you have the slightest feeling that something's off it's fucking off okay do not trust any of them this could have been people you worked with i love you guys Please be careful and have a safe night. You do have abundance and victory coming your way. So that's freaking awesome. Just keep doing you, boo. And watch your life grow. For real. Just fuck these people. You can get way better. Love you guys.